hi everyone and welcome in the previous video we have covered that how we can read a holding register data of our modbus tcp ip device in the node read okay now in this video we will see how we can read the input register data of our modbus tcp ip device in the node read so here is our previous flow okay and here is our simulator uh, using open mode same software now we want to read the input register data so in the simulator what we can do is we can select the input register here okay and we can simulate the first input register with maximum value 100 and we can simulate our last input register with the maximum value 200 okay and uh, we can also simulate this one okay so we have simulated this three uh, input register and we want to read the data of this input register in the node read so i am going to you know disable these things okay node disable selected node and again i'm going to take modbus read node okay and again we will take debug node to display the data in the debug window again i'm going to take one more debug node okay uh, let's take another debug node here and one more here okay and we are going to read the input register so read input register the unit id is one and the function code we have to select is a read input register the address starting address is zero the quantity we want to read is 10 the poll rate is one second so here we have to select one second and we are going to use the same modbus client because the ip address and port number we haven't changed okay so in the modbus client you can see node read modbus client type is tcp ip address port number is same localhost 10502 that's it okay we can press done and uh, here i'm going to print my first input register okay in the node status and for this one i'm going to display the fifth okay so zero one two three four so here we have to provide four okay and uh, here we have to provide nine i guess yeah okay so that's it we can deploy our flow Control d to deploy our flow okay you can see 73 8 16 okay so it will continuously read the data from this simulator okay and this debug node will display all the data in the debug window and this three node will directly display the input register status in the node status only okay you can see that okay so this is how you can use node read to read the input register data of any of your modbus tcp devices okay you can mention the starting address you can mention the quantity here you can mention the poll rate you can mention what type of data we want to read so it's an input register you can mention the unit id so if you have multiple devices okay and if you have a multiple unit id of those devices then you can mention that device id here so it will only read the data from that device id only okay so i hope this thing is clear that how to use node read to read the input register data of any of your you know morbus tcp device now in the next video we will cover that how to read the coil status of your morbus tcp ip device in the node read okay so instead of input register we are going to use the same node to read the coil status okay so let's meet in the next video and if you still have any question or any doubt regarding this then you can always ping me on telegram instagram anywhere okay also you can put your questions in the comment section i'll happy to answer your questions so let's meet in the next video till then take care goodbye and thank you